Welcome back, everyone, to the final segment of the night with more Virtue's Last Reward. Alice is opening up to us, and she's going to tell us about, about herself and the Myrmidons if we just don't tell Clover that she's been trying. Really? Good. All right, then. What, was that vacation like 3,000 years ago or something? I hope it was. Ah, uh, maybe not. Everyone's really into cloning in this game. I'm not sure if you can just use their resources to conduct your own private investigation just because you're working for them. Or at least you're not supposed to. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I remember that. <laughs> Just think about that metaphor. That does sound pretty difficult. Yeah, remember that location, all right. Wait, really? They were there? I don't remember seeing any Dio's there. Okay, that doesn't really explain why you were wearing that. Is this some kind of deep cover operation?
I guess we're just gonna ignore that part. Yeah, apparently, uh, Akane and Santa just disappeared without a trace. Never seen again. Yeah, what happened to him? We could also call him Ace for some reason. Wait, uh, really? Are we connecting Free to Soul to uh, Ace's company? I thought Ace's reason for the original Nonary game and trying to access the morphogenetic field was because he just wanted to see people's faces. He just wanted to recognize people's faces. That's all he wanted. You know, that's true, Alice. We've never heard of that before. Just tell us all about it. Yep, I remember. I remember this. Mm-hmm. Top agents, indeed. Well, yeah, yeah, I imagine she would have been. It's true, they've never mentioned Snake. And I guess he would be needed for uh, Clover's powers to work.
啊、oh.。I then cut the skin off his chest so I could have that message forever. This time, we wouldn't let Clover anywhere near the mission. Ah, oh, so it hadn't happened yet. Yes. Well, there it is. Everything that's happened with the Myrmidons and me. I left a few of the details out, of course, but you get the idea. We should go back. Which is? Yes. What do you propose we do? Clues? Hmm. Well, if I could decrypt that code, it might tell us something, but... I never thought about clues before. I told you. We need a key. Hmm, I wonder where we could get a key. Without that, it's pointless. A key is a key. It allows you to sort of unlock a code. The Myrmidons usually use this huge string of numbers as a key. <laughs> oh, 
What the hell? So did we just pass a plot lock right there? It looked like we did. Where did... Wait. Can you say that again? That's 198,449,351 to the third power. Wow, she is good at math. That number you just told me. Prime factor decomposition on that number gets you 198,449,351 to the third power. Exactly. You probably learned that in junior high, right? Yes. I did do all of that in my head. Simple mental arithmetic. I told you, I'm better at math than most people. <laughs> Look at you. You just recited a huge string of numbers. That seems pretty astounding, too. Yeah, how did we know that string of numbers? Where did you find that number anyway? Oh, uh, probably read it somewhere. In like a book. Can't tell me, huh? Fine. I'm pretty sure that's the key to the code, though. I know the Myrmidons use prime factors for their keys. And there aren't a lot of 25-digit numbers that turn out to be the third power of a prime number. I think there's a very good chance that number you memorized was specifically created by someone. Well, look at the prime factors of your number. 198,449,351 to the third power. I think that's our hint for cracking the code. You still don't get it? Try to remember the code we saw in the infirmary. What did it say on the monitor? Oh, I've memorized that too, did we? On the second row? Wow, you've got a pretty impressive memory. We could really use someone like you back at the... Um... At, back at the... Wherever it is I work, I don't know. You use 198,449,351 to point you to the right letters. Well, the first number is 1, so take the first letter. The next number is nine, so go nine letters over from the first one, then eight from that one. Just keep going until you get something. Make sense? Until you get something? All right. When it says the game is over, does Alice just solve it for you, or or what? What do you do? What happens then? Oh, fail and the game is over. It just ends. Is there an, a some sort of um? So there's no reason for it. It's just uh, it just stops right here. All right, let's fail it and see what happens.
You what? Are you serious? What? Oh, just forget it. <laughs> I'll figure it out on my own. Stay where you are! <laughs> she is so angry at our inability to solve this. I don't have any use for another brain-dead man. Who said nothing special would happen? We got to see Alice real mad at us because we couldn't solve the puzzle. <laughs> nah, it doesn't show a game over or anything. It just has the uh, the path there. That's kind of unusual that there is a uh, a puzzle that's not in a puzzle room. It's in a novel section. However, I can tell that I am not going to get this tonight because I'm just way too tired to think about the puzzles. So we'll have to end the stream here and we'll continue on with this when we start VLR next week. We'll try to decode the code and try to work it out. So have a good night, everyone. No, I don't want you to solve it for me. That's really not the point of, of the game. Uh, so that's what we'll continue doing when we start off next week. Then we'll probably, whoops, hold on. We'll probably start off once we finish that. Probably do that chromatic door choice unless, no. It does not look like anything has actually unlocked. Just a doing a quick check. There's this. Who planted the bomb? And that seems to be the only plot... Oh, no. There's this as well. Five minutes of life. What do we do in the five minutes left? We don't know what to do. I, I really have no idea what we're supposed to do in that five minutes. And also, of course, solve the mystery of the two-headed lion. Those are the things that are blocking us. So... We know now that this is Alice's path. We know that on the left is Luna's, then K, then Dio, then Ten, then Quark, then Clover, then Alice. Over on the right is Phi. So this one path that we have not... Whoops. Keep clicking on things. This one path that we have not taken, that ah, that starts on the chromatic doors, has to be Sigma's. So it'll be interesting to see what is on that path. But that's it for this week. Have a good night, everyone. I'll see you next time as I try to make a serious attempt at solving the puzzle. Um, because, yeah, it's it's not fun if you just tell me the answers. I mean, if I make a serious attempt and then I'm just lost, yeah, yeah, you tell me the answer, and then we just continue on to keep things moving. But I really should make a serious attempt at it before you do that, and I'm just not in the condition to do that right now. So I'm sorry about that, but... We'll see what happens next time. We've uh, Tonight, we've continued on the Adventures of Bully Demise as the killing situation really is heating up. We started off Space Funeral, which worked, and uh, we gave too much blood to the wizard, so hopefully we'll rectify that last uh, next time. Do I think I'm going to do a marathon to finish the game off? It depends on how things work out. How, um how much of the game we have left by the time we're starting to get to the end of uh, of WWE 2K14. Trying to balance those two. I'm not sure which is going to end first. Um, but we'll see what happens as no stream next week. No, no, it's... Uh, hold on. No, no, next week, the 24th, is the second to last Saturday of May. So we still have a stream next week.
The 31st is the last Saturday of May. So that's when we take our break. Um, but there is a stream next week. So just remember that. Stream next week, no, st no stream the week after. So next week we'll continue on, try to solve this puzzle, and then hopefully get Alice's ending, which seems to be very close at this point, and then we'll see what options we have at that point in time. So I'll see you next time, see you next week. Have a good week, everyone. I hope you had fun, because I always do. And if we're not having fun, then what's the point of even doing this? Have a good night. <laughs>